everyone and welcome. This is Melissa Armo and I'm looking at the August tracking. Last couple of days were challenging uh, and, and as I'm going to go over the tracking here since last week but we'll take a look at it. I mean it's still a good month but you know some days are easier than others. I'm hoping tomorrow is an easier day we're going to see. Some days it seems like you work so hard for the money and then some days it just falls right into your lap. Obviously those are many of my days, but I wish it was every day, quite frankly. So let's look here at where we're at for this month. If you'd like more information, you can email me at melissathestockswoosh.com. So far in in August, I'm still was a winner. Biggest winner here for the month as far as the gap itself or the movement that the gap had from the high to the low. Um, not the biggest winner trade profit-wise. I mean, I just got out of it too early here, it's obvious. But I mean, when you look at where I took that trade and where it went in the day, you're like, wow. And actually, uh, this swooshed. That's something you learn in the class. But this had a massive move. And, you know, looking at gap wise, at the quality of gaps, this really was the biggest winner for the month of August to, to date. So, cake was a good one, first of the month. That was another nice gap. Really didn't have as big of a move as, as Macy's, but ended up hitting that harder. Trip was very good too. SYMC, another solid gap. Off for a few days. DBX was good. Uh, that was a short. That had a bigger day the second day, actually. Qs were a good one on the 13th along. HD was a loser, and the Qs were a winner on the 14th. 15th was Macy's. It's just a solid, beautiful, amazing win and good gap. WMT was another good gap, though, actually. Um, and looking at that now, you're like, wow, because that was a long. One loser, then a retake that was a nice winner. DF was a loser on the 17th. AMAT did two trades in that. One was a loser, one was a small winner. Ultimately, that day was a losing day. And some days, there's just nothing you can do about it. You're going to have a loss. And that was one of those days in Friday, just things were not following through. 20th, the Qs were a loser. EL was a loser, even though we were up in that. Missed the exit on that. And the same thing, uh, you know, looking overall at the market, you're like, wait a minute. This was a long, market was a long. Why didn't these things cooperate? They just didn't. Market moved then later on in the morning, and then the SPY was a winner, and that was a long, this was on Monday. The 21st ETFC was a loser, and HPE was a winner. So all in all, not quite the end of the month. I mean, we still have some time here left in this month, uh, and it is Labor Day in a week and a half, but so far, nice profitable month here, 22285 so far in August, which is totally doable, especially when you're you're looking at things and you've got a lot of things to look at. And I'm willing to look at longs when we don't have a lot of shorts, which some of those trades were longs, even though I do veer to the to the short side first. Trading, you gotta remember, is a skill. It's a skill that you will use and you will apply it in the market daily for the purpose of making profit. And that is what I do. So I rate the gap in the morning, I prepare by rating it, going through the checklist, do, do, do. Going through all of it, finding the right ticker symbols, taking the trades, putting the stops in, watching the trades, and trying to get in and out early. Some of those ones were longer holds, which which if that's what it is, it is. If we got to make money, we got to hold it. But I will tell you, though, that the best trades are quick in and out. Love those kinds of trades. If you'd like more information and you want to take my class, it's this weekend, August 25th and 26th. It's the Golden Gap course. You will learn everything about my method to pick those ticker symbols that we just reviewed for this month. In order to be able to join the live trading room, you have to take the class, okay? So you'll be eligible to do so by doing the course this weekend to get my calls, like the ones I just called here and were reviewed for August. So it is 9 to 5 Eastern Time, $54.99 US dollars. Class is online. You can be anywhere in the world and take it. And then the trends class is Monday the 27th. Combo class tuition is $59.99. You save $500 by signing up for that as well. That talks about long-term swing trades. If you're interested in the trends class, that's the 27th. And the golden gap is Saturday and Sunday. So learn everything I know, okay? Bottom line is you can do this. Having to mentor someone like me, teaching you, you know, saying this is a good one, this is a good one, here's the target. That helps you, helps you in the room. But it is definitely possible for you to make this kind of money using a system that has a high win ratio, which mine does. And, and, and I'm telling you, when you understand what to do and you're able to assess what the risk to reward is in the trades and you're able to just have the confidence, have the conviction to hit it, you can really do well. And actually Walmart's a great, was a great example of that because that took two tries. It really, really did. And you know, when you, sometimes when you really love something and stick on top of it, you learn a lot about yourself. And I think that that part of yourself that understands, do you really have what it takes to do this and put the size on and take the trades and all of that helps. It really, really helps you. So we'll see what we get for the rest of the month and we will go from there.
Good luck, everyone. If you're interested in more information, email me at melissa at thestockswitch.com if you want to sign up for the class.